hard enough? Can you simply hypnotize your kids into doing what you want them to do or to sleep all the way through the night? No, I don't think so, but it's a theory worth trying. The Rabbit Who Wants to Go to Sleep is a book that some parents swear works for their kids. But of course, I tried it, and the results were less than optimal. The more he logs for his bed back. So when I was sent The Rabbit Who Wants to Go to Harvard, written by Diana Hallquist, I decided to try again and see if I could convince Allison that she really wanted to go to an Ivy League university. After all, she's five. It's time. Now this rabbit, he wants to go to Harvard. What do you think about that? What's Harvard? <laughs> oh, good question. Plus, getting into Harvard has to be easier than getting a kid to sleep. This book also comes with a warning, just like the rabbit who wants to go to sleep. The author and publisher take no responsibility when your child ends up in therapy. Well, let's get this manipulation underway. In this in-between place right before achieving, I control your mind. You, Allison, will do what I say. Hey. You, Allison, will obey. You, Allison, will go to Harvard. <laughs> now don't flip out. There are a couple swear words in this book, but I didn't read them to my five-year-old niece. I'm not crazy, and I didn't tell her about the vodka. I figure if she gets into Harvard, she'll learn about all those things there. Tonight, Ronald's siblings fell asleep faster than usual. Can you do this? Oh yeah, that's good. What's that mean? Mm, well, Maybe you don't do that at school. Okay. I'm so glad I could teach Allison to make the shape of an L on her forehead. Hey now, she's an all-star. The kids who read this book are taught to put away childish thoughts and joys because she doesn't need those things if she wants to go to Harvard. You, Allison, feel you cannot make it, but you can. You must. Keep reading. If you can't get through this simple children's book, how will you, Allison, even get into Harvard? <laughs> how? <laughs> Plus, you don't really need the Adderall. Your mom's going to pay for a college coach to get you into Harvard. Do you think he should let college coach Kitty write his essay? No, but his mom paid her $4,000. Oh, well, that's a lot. If your mom pays someone $4,000, do you think they should maybe write your essay? Well, they should do something. <laughs> you should do that. Oh, You're yeah. losing your money. That's true. You're right. You should probably do what was right instead. <laughs> oh. Honesty is the best policy, unless you want to get into Harvard now. Okay. Yeah. I think you could get into Harvard, Allison. I think it's good. You do? I think that would be awesome. If you go to Harvard, can I come? Yeah. Really? Ah, uh, parenting self-help books. Every parent wants that magic trick that makes their kids do what they want them to do, without really considering that kids are people with their own minds. And you can't just teach them tricks like a circus animal. Not that you should do that either.